Hello everyone, this is ASM Arif. Today, welcoming you to my new illustrated tutorial. Today, I'll show you how to make a logo like that. Uh, line logo actually, uh, I just made it with the uh, shapes. Uh, it's uh, that too much easy and after that I just uh, expand it and apply the um, gradient okay at first I'm taking the gradient uh, I'm just uh, this one I'm taking a shapes and press I and take the gradient and I'll apply this one and I can uh, show you how to make this gradient okay let's start the tutorial at first I'm going to the file and take the new options or control or command in for the new window or new canvas or artboard whatever you can tell okay i'm taking the thousand by thousand uh, artboard and giving the name of this artboard logo and hit the create button if you are uh, new in my channel please do subscribe my channel and share with your friend and uh, press the bell icon for the new notification when i'll publish my new tutorials okay uh, after that I just uh, this one is my artboard after that I'll go to the shapes and draw a rectangle and turn off the stroke and give the uh, just gradient color here is the gradient uh, adjustment layer and panel this uh, bar in this panel go to the window and go to the gradient options gradient or control f9 you'll get this one okay i'll change the color or the gradient mixture uh, like that uh, just select here double click over there and i'm taking this color and taking another color like that double click over there and taking here or you can adjust the colors uh, by selecting manually suppose this one this slider you can change and just double click over there you can pick up uh, color from here like this and just click once and go to here and you can select the color like that okay you can get this type of color easily or gradient you can put uh, two colors and make the gradient okay now i'm going to the shapes okay i'm just uh, taking an ellipse tool and making a circle and giving the color which is the black and that is the field color i'm turning off the field color just like that and just giving the stroke color and stroke thickness for four or six pt that's good and just i want to make it in a middle position that's why i'll go to the alignment if you are not getting this icon or alignment icon over there or alignment tool over there go to the window and the first one alignment uh, window and alignment you'll get this one and make this one uh, align with the artboard and make it in a middle position okay after that and go to the uh, polygon tool and uh, after that go to the polygon tool and press once and uh, write down here six for the uh, hexagon and make it hundred and hit okay and after that go to the selection tool and just rotate this one by rotating uh, how to rotate this one uh, press the shift options and rotate this one and you'll get this type of shapes and make it bigger by pressing ctrl or uh, only the shift button okay select these two things um, just key like that and, and alignment key alignment elements like that and make it in a center okay after that select this just a hexagon and make it like that and after that go to the pen tool and select in those section or you can find out the middle point of this one or if you are uh, not uh, admit to take the risk to layer or the size properly just select here press the escape button and select in this anchor point and in this anchor point just escape button uh, this anchor point and this anchor point skip button and you'll get this type of or uh, this okay you're getting this okay uh, this select actually you should uh, make bigger the lines otherwise it won't be cut down properly okay then just how to do that just select all the things and just press the shape button you will just deselect this one the shape and only the line will select and then make it bigger like that and make it select this 
and just defy that and press the ungroup option right button and select these two things and or you can uh, use the shape builders tool like that just select these two uh, all the things like that okay uh, here is some problem that's why i'm just moving this ellipse tool and i'll use that later and select uh, the shapes and go to the shape builders tool and select these two these two and these two uh, and after that i'll make it stroke this one also stroke and this one also stroke and give the stroke thickness six uh four is good three four three that's good or you can make uh, four is good okay four five around five or the okay and you can move that okay how to move just i'm moving like that and giving this portion like that yeah and here also okay that's good you are getting a shape and press ctrl g for group all the things and select these two things make it in a key position and make it alignment like that and you can make it smaller like that press the control and shift button and like that use this as this one and you can give name other things or the things okay those are stroke yet uh, and that's why i'm going to the object uh, this one is important but just because of if you not expand it properly uh, otherwise what problem will happen suppose you are making it smaller it will be more thicker and the uh, not uh, getting the uh, shapes in a properly okay that's why before make it smaller before make it uh, bigger go to the object and expand it and hit the ok button it will be shaped and then you can make it smaller it will be keep same and bigger it will be same okay after that this time is apply for the, the gradient tool go to the just press the i and just give here okay select all the things and press G and just like that okay but uh, we need to give the uh, dark background that's why I'm going to the rectangle tool and select here uh, rectangle and going to the blacks option and make it um, this background layer um, I should send it back control shift and third bracket opening okay you are getting this one you can make it more darker and you will get this one okay thank you so much thanks for watching my video tutorial if you have any kind of question or query please do comment in my video comment section and till the next video i am asmanip signing out and bye bye